I'm Diana, you're watching Physics Girl, and in this video I have a super special guest. Her name is Simone Yetch, and I'm sure that you've seen her somewhere with her amazing, hilarious robots. Simone agreed to answer some physics riddles on this video, and I hope you're not mad about this because I know you love getting the answers right away. But the first riddle is in this video, and then you have to come back tomorrow to get the answer to the riddle and to get the next riddle. So, here's the video. All right. Physics is serious. It's we need serious to put business. on our serious faces. Can you tell my viewers like what your channel is? You do robotics. I, I, I'm not sure I can tell anyone what it is. It's a weird mix, but I do some sort of like robot comedy. So I build robots that don't work really well. I build these like kind of useless machines as a way of entertaining people. Check it out. Check it out. But not before you watch this video. Oh, I will put a link in the description. But little known fact, you studied physics in school. But I dropped out after a year. I'm sorry. <laughs> so yeah. we're going to bring you back into the physics world. And I've got some physics questions for you. It makes me really nervous because I feel like I will finally be caught with not being super smart. Because I was a straight A kid in school, I was a total pe teacher's pet, and then like somehow in my like mid twenties, it just started going downward. Right now, you, I need some physics DPR need some water. water. Are you ready for the first question? Here's a little warm up. It's something a little bit more mechanical, so okay. I think you may be a little more familiar. So bicycles have a left-handed screw somewhere on the bicycle. Where do you think it is and why do you think it's there? Pause here if you want to think about the question for a second before we go on. On the pedal, because when you pedal, it can't unscrew itself. Yes. Really? Yes. Uh, you didn't know, you didn't know that? I'm not that stupid. No. I was, that was just thinking that brilliant. the only reason you need a left hand screw is so you don't unscrew it. Okay, is it maybe on? not everything is lost. No, that was really okay. good. That was really good. Which pedal? Do you have any idea? So it's righty <laughs> I always think of like if you go against the time, so the time goes like that for the viewer. The, the clock, the yeah, clock. Yeah. yeah. You have a screw loose, and so that's how you. Oh, so that's like my own righty tighty, but I know right. here in the states people do righty tighty. Righty tighty, lefty loosey, but that doesn't rhyme in Swedish. I'm guessing. So I guess it'd be on the. It'd be on the left side from the person's perspective. I don't actually know the answer. <laughs> the answer is the left side, but the explanation as to why is actually not that straightforward. So if you have an explanation, leave it in the comments or tweet it at Simone. Tell her I sent you. Now that was really impressive. It's all I want is to impress you. It's all I've ever wanted. I'm really proud of you as if I had anything to do with your success. <laughs> We're done with the warm up. On to the riddles. Oh, okay. that was the warm up. Okay. <laughs> Are you ready? Yes. You've got two spheres, two balls that are of different materials. So say one is like made of iron and one is made of wood, where okay. one is lighter than the other, but they're the exact same size. You drop them from a really, really tall height. So say you drop them out of a plane or something. Mm -hmm. Which one experiences the higher force of air resistance? Once the balls reach terminal velocity. If they have yeah. the same surface and they're treated with say, a coat of epoxy. Right. Yeah. Okay. So <laughs> imagine that they are treated with the yeah. coating of epoxy and so they have the same surface. Are they the same size? They're the exact same size. Okay. Yeah. But one is heavier than the other one. And this is where I tell you to come back tomorrow for the answer. It's like vegetables. I know that you don't like them, but they're so good for your brain. But in the meantime, I will be on Facebook. I'll be on Twitter. I'll be in the comments if you have questions about the questions or if you just want to say hi, please say hi. Thank you for watching and check out Simone's channel and happy physics things.